that should be rolling the camera looks like it is so I'm going to I increase to level assist 5 just in case we need the extra power and head down Church Road now which we haven't gone down yet as soon as these cars pass we will head down <sighs> we let these cars pass pump our brakes make sure they see us and we see them clip in here then we'll go out on Church Road with the rest of the gang. So we'll make one more stop here to check. It's a giant truck coming down, riding the shoulder, but it looks like he's getting over there. So we'll head down Church. A lot of power and assist five. So, we're going to maintain our speed at 30 miles an hour, 30 miles an hour, we got a car behind us, so we're going to take up the entire lane, and turn left onto Church Road, we've got the light now, Big truck behind us. I don't know why he needs to come that close to me. Turning lane. Headlights not on. Headlights are now on. Going through the intersection. And we're now on the shoulder of church. I'm gonna put my visor down because it's very windy out. And stay to the right. Come on, bro. Pass. Alright, he just passed. Seems like that's it for cars for now. Doing 36. Need eyes ahead. Avoid this patch here. Head on through. Why is it saying that someone is behind me? Another car. truck is stopped right in my path. So we're going to pull up behind it and then go around it. Watch as this guy opens his door. And go past. Keep my balance, stay cool, only doing 30 miles an hour, 
Watching out for any debris in the road. Little narrow here. So we may need to get into the lane a little bit. And continuing on down. Real gusts out here. No traffic behind me right now. Going up a hill here. Wind is really blowing my head around. Gotta keep my chin tucked. Give a little bit of the gas going up the hill. I know that's gonna need some battery. Now we got a car coming up. Make sure he sees us passing on the left another one clear want us to stay in the lane here Now we got to turn left, no cars behind me, so we turn left here, turn right into here, brother's not there. Alright, now where to go from here? So we go up here. And then go right. Uh, oh, we could get Mount Laurel Road again from here by going down the elbow. And we can get that by going down through this office building here. I think there's a way to get out the back. Nope, not of here. Gotta go around one more. here. If we can pass by this dude's car. Take Union Mill down to Mount Laurel Road. Go all the way down Mount Laurel Road into Morristown. Might be safer than church. Just gotta watch for cars coming out from here. So we're going down Union Mill Road to get Mount Laurel Road. We'll pass behind Laurel Acres Park where we've gone before. We've got a car coming here. Hopefully they're paying attention. Pumping my brakes. So they can pass on the left, very close to me. Uh, now I don't know if this FedEx guy sees me or not.
very windy out here today. I'm sure you guys can hear that. No cars, so we're clear. Can I take Mount Laurel Road all the way down? And just keep it at 25. No problems with the cops. Be a big steep hill here. A lot of battery drain. I don't think there's any way to avoid it. So we go. See if they see us. They see us. Anyone turning right? Anyone behind me? And then we just head on up the hill. Hopefully there's no one behind us. And we're heading into Morristown. This is where I grew up. Went to high school. We got a super steep hill up there. That we're going to try to get through. And maybe find a different route home. Because this is eating some serious battery. cars so far on my six no cars on my six definitely passing these folks on the right looking for anybody trying to cut over left no right turn so far really not we got one right turn here Here, one oh, turn on red right here. Uh, lights about to change. This is historic Morristown Main Street. Oh yes, and we got a sidewalk here. So sweet. Go nice and easy on the sidewalk here. Make sure nobody's turning right into here. Go across. Yup. Uh, all brick. I could show you my school that I went to for lower, middle, and high school. It's on the left here. It's a Quaker school. Let me know in the comments below if you've ever heard of Quakerism. Brownie points without Googling it. If you could tell me what Quakerism is about in, in the shortest number of words. So this is a nice little... Uh, main town here and that is the school back there I'm not gonna go there especially not with a camera I don't want anybody calling a cop the cops on me but we've got some restaurants and stuff down further and if I pass by those give people the right of way on the sidewalks make sure that no one runs me over because it, it's kind of a busy area how much bike we got 80.4 volts so we'll probably just go all the way down this and take church all the way home that looks well like what it's going to be Gotta always watch out for cars coming out on the right here at these banks. Drive through areas. Like, there's not a lot of wiggle room here. Maybe just get on the main road here. 
and hope that nobody opens their car door on me. I'll show you where I go a lot for the only place I hit up anymore for sushi. I've hit up like almost every spot around here, but this is the only place I, I absolutely trust. And that is, its name is Akira. Akira in Moorestown. I don't know if anyone's there yet. It's noon. So we might say hi to anyone in there. If they're there, um, I don't see anyone else in there, but just saying hi. I don't know, they're probably like, who is this, and why are they here? So then we got a Starbucks up here, and some other small shops. Again, we got to watch out for cars coming through here. Um, I don't know how well I can ride this sidewalk down, but... We can try. This tends to be a pretty busy area. So, I'm not trying to have people open their car doors on me. Probably get back on the sidewalk further up there. I don't know if we're allowed to have side bikes on the sidewalk here or not. And we'll just take church back down home. Just walk the bike down very slowly, show you the shops. You've got little, all these driveways in between, so you never know when cars are coming through. So not trying to take my foot off. So, yeah, I'm pretty excited that we got up here all right in one piece. And respect these people's privacy. Get off the sidewalk a little bit. through what are these people hi god please please god yeah. excuse me excuse me we're walking down Morristown this is considered walking Really vibrant area, historical area. Uh, Pre-COVID, this place would just be completely, completely filled with people, especially in the summer. Younger crowd. Uh, here's another place I used to come to a lot. Passarello's. It's an Italian or family-owned restaurant. Right here. Just walking on through. Get a little glimpse inside. And then this is where I get my shoes and orthotics. It's a place called Carl's Shoes on the right. Right here, for all your special shoe needs, this is where I come. So we're going to pass. Excuse me. We've got a, I think it's think uh no it's the primary school and a church here and then as you can see there's some businesses along here 
some banks. <sighs> Electric barbering, which I've never seen before. Nice little town. If uh, any of you guys come down to ride, definitely check it out. And get some food here. There is a uh, there's a what you call it. There's a yeah. I'm being distracted by that cop there right now because I think I'm gonna cross over and take this down. All the way down church. Don't want to jinx myself, but Morristown cops tend to be really nice. Uh, I've seen them a lot in public and they greet you, they smile. Never had any problems with them at all. So this guy's turning left. Making sure he doesn't run me over, which is really nice. Now I can go without getting crushed. And then we will go over this way after. Once the light changes, I might be blocking this crosswalk a little bit. I've got about five seconds. And then we can go once it turns red, uh, green. Yeah, I kind of just forgot what I was saying before. Hopefully the video is still rolling. We'll find out once we pass this light. <laughs> I'm going to check the camera real quick. Make sure we're still on. And then we're going to head on home. Looks like we're still rolling. Just to make sure, we're going to get the... Uh, Chesty cam on for the rest of the ride. So, here we go. Back on down to where we came from. Slightly different route. See which one we like better if we ever come back up this way. It's a good time to test it out. Coming up this way wasn't too bad uh, in terms of traffic and any close calls or anything like that. But, maybe this is a better route. Another place we can check out another time is we can ride through and around the mall. That might be kind of different. Tejas is not riding today. Oh, the sidewalk just ends here. just ends just like that. So we're going to get back on a little further down once it's clear. Like right here. And keep continuing on our way. I mean, that was a quick circuit. About 10 miles. I don't. I think we just went straight from the house. Uh, stopped off in the parking lot of my brother's um, restaurant. First, second. That doesn't really increase the distance traveled. And then just brought it right back. So... 
we had that little strip down more Mason Main Street I don't even know if that's a half a mile but wasn't too bad and that's gonna conclude the vlog for today guys thank you for tuning in I hope you enjoyed seeing the town I grew up in maybe one day we can pass by my my old house and there's really no turn on red here but I'm going anyways um yeah, and if any of you guys live in the Northeast USA um, and want to join me at any time, you are more than welcome. I'd love to have you. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.